Living on Pluto would be a daunting task, as it is a distant and frigid dwarf planet located at the edge of our solar system. With an average temperature of minus 375 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 225 degrees Celsius, it is much colder than any place on Earth, and its atmosphere is very thin and composed mainly of nitrogen and methane. Firstly, Pluto has no solid surface for humans to stand on and its environment would be hostile to human life. The extreme cold and low atmospheric pressure would make it impossible to survive without special equipment and protective suits. Additionally, because Pluto is so far from the Sun, it receives very little sunlight, which would make it difficult to generate energy and support human settlements. Alternative sources of energy, such as nuclear or geothermal power, would likely need to be used. Furthermore, Pluto has a very thin and tenuous atmosphere, which would not provide adequate protection from cosmic radiation and other hazards. Any human settlements on Pluto would require extensive shielding to protect against these hazards. Overall, while it is unlikely that humans will ever live on Pluto due to its hostile environment, there is still much to be learned about this distant world. NASA's New Horizons mission, which flew by Pluto in 2015, provided unprecedented insights into Pluto's geology, atmosphere, and moons, and future missions may continue to uncover new discoveries about this fascinating dwarf planet. Pluto has five known moons, named Charon, Nix, Hydra, Kerberos, and Styx. Charon is by far the largest of these moons and is actually large enough to be considered a dwarf planet in its own right. If humans were to live on Pluto, they would face many of the same challenges as they would on Neptune, such as the lack of breathable air, extreme temperatures, and harsh conditions. In addition, Pluto's distance from the Sun means that it receives very little sunlight, which would make it difficult to generate energy and grow food. The harsh environment on Pluto would require humans to rely on advanced technology and infrastructure to survive such as underground habitats that are shielded from the extreme temperatures and radiation. Any human settlement on Pluto would also need to be completely self-sufficient, as resupply missions from Earth would be extremely difficult and expensive. NASA's New Horizons mission, which launched in 2006 and conducted a flyby of Pluto in 2015, provided important insights into the dwarf planet and its moons. The mission revealed many previously unknown features on Pluto, including a large heart-shaped region on its surface, as well as a diverse landscape of mountains, valleys, and plains. New Horizons also conducted flybys of Pluto's moons, providing important information about their composition and structure. For example, the mission revealed that Charon has a heavily cratered surface and a large canyon system suggesting that it may have experienced significant geological activity in the past. Overall, while living on Pluto would present many challenges, it remains an intriguing destination for scientific exploration and discovery. Living on Pluto would be a daunting task, as it is a distant and frigid dwarf.